guys, uh, welcome back. We're going to be doing something a little bit different today. And what it is, I've decided to upgrade the RAM on my MacBook Pro. So I thought we'd do a bit of a, a run through, show you how it all works. It might be really exciting. Or you might just have six minutes of relaxed sleep. We'll see how it goes. So there we go, guys. I've started taking the screws off. Off the back cover, we've got it on on the uh, on the bench upside down. And okay, we're speeding it up now because let's face it, there's only so many times you can see a screw being taken out with it not being too exciting. So we're just whizzing around there. I don't know if you can see what I'm doing, guys, but what I'm trying to do is put the screws next to the holes, so I know exactly which holes are going into when I come to put them back. So we're coming towards the end of the first speeding up bit, and there we go, slow it down for the last screw. And then what we'll do after this screw comes out, we'll take the cover off and have a quick look inside the MacBook Pro. So there we go, and doesn't it look dirty? <laughs> Hats off to, uh, to Apple. Uh, they really do make good computers. This one has really worked hard through its life, and I'm just trying to squeeze every ounce of power that it's got to give. So there you go, guys. Uh, you can see there the CD-ROM underneath. That's the hard drive. I've got a one terabyte hard drive in there. There, the big black thing's the battery, and there's your there's your memory, your RAM. I've currently got 8 gig in, so there's two strips of 4 gig. So what we'll do, we'll just change camera angle. And just quickly show you the new stuff. I've bought this second hand. It was uh, two strips of 8 gig memory for around £56, which I think is good value. And I've been lucky enough to get a matching pair. So we'll just remove the old ones first. And you do that by pulling across these little plastic levers. I know my hand's in the way, but you just see now it's just popped up there. So you pull it up a bit further, and then you get both hands on and just give it a little wiggle out of the slot. Superb. So there's the old memory, guys, some crucial 4 gig. So it's two sticks of 4 gig. So the second one is below it. It's the same principle. Just pull the little plastic tags apart. You can see it coming up. I think I just had to squeeze it across a bit further. Yes, and there we go. I say, it's all exciting with my hands in the way there. You can't see a thing, can you? But what, what can you do? <laughs> and there we go. There's a the second one. So I will be selling these guys. Um, Put it on Facebook Marketplace, get a bit of cash back. So there we go, we got the first stick of the new one. Just just remember to line up the little slot. Make sure you put it the right way up, otherwise you'll be struggling. Because it won't go in. And all you do is push it in towards the slot and then down. And it clips into place. Very simple. The second one's exactly the same. Again, lovely shots of our hand there. I think I just needed to push it in a bit further. There you go, just saw it there. Riveting TV, this. Okay. Yeah, just making sure it's in nice and tight. So now, just bring the, the camera around a little bit. Just for a final shot. Okay. So it's, as you were, pretty much reverse. I could have cheated and just reversed the video, but I'm not going to. It should start to speed up in a minute. Let's just have a look. And any second now, sorry, I'm just watching the timeline as I'm video, as I'm speaking to you, and go. So, okay, it's uh, basically put all the screws back in. I think I changed my... Screw bit, which was slipping a little bit. I think I put a slightly bigger head on. 
Can't go wrong with a bigger head. I've been told quite often. So I think what I did, I put all the screws in first and the really tiny guys are my big chunky fingers there struggling. Well, pretty simple. Again, a shout out to Apple. Really well designed laptop. Easy to work on. I do believe the later models, uh, I think it was 2013 onwards, are a bit of a pain to work on. But like I say, I'm trying to squeeze every ounce of this laptop I can. The poor thing. It, uh, it'll be kicking and screaming while I'm doing certain things to it. But... Uh, yeah, so there we go. Just double check the nice and tight. Not too tight, you don't want to thread anything. Okay, so it's all back together now. I've connected it back to my monitor and I just wanted to show you. It's now showing 16 gig. Fantastic professional camera wobble there. You can't get that anywhere else on YouTube, guys. There we go, 16 gig. And that's pretty much it. Just goes over to confirm what's on the memory slots. There we go, 2 gigs of 8. Or 2 slots of 8 gig. Okay guys, thanks for watching. Please do like, share and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.